Good morning Year 4, this is my hints and tips video for the Making Shapes lesson today. So we'll start again by asking this question, what is area? Okay. So you should know that Area is the space inside a shape, and if we want to make it more mathematically correct, in a side a 2D shape, which just means a flat shape. So I think you're going to find most of the work today uh, straightforward. So if you're asked to draw a shape with the given area, so the area here for 1a is 7 squares um, you will cut in a square okay so at the moment I've drawn a shape that has an area of 1 square and you will then draw continue to draw a shape that has an area of seven squares and then here 13 squares and here draw two different shapes each with an area of eight squares so I think the other question is quite straightforward so I skipped on to question four which says Amir has created a shape my shape has an area of 10 squares and is rectilinear. Okay, and rectilinear means formed by right angles and straight lines. Okay, so tick the shapes that Amir could have made. Right, so we know that they, each shape must have an area of 10 squares. So straight away you can go through and systematically count the number of squares all right and i'm going to show you the shape that is not rectilinear okay and the shape that is not rectilinear is this one and it's because if it was made uh, with right angles it would need to this angle would need to be part of the yellow shape okay so that's why it's not rectilinear and so with that one and that one they would all need to be part of the yellow shape so now we're moving on to question five um, which says I cannot make a large square using an odd number of smaller squares do you agree with Whitney Okay, and the clue I'm going to give you for this one is um, those special square numbers. Okay, so I'm just going to go through and show you what I mean. 1 times 1, 2 times 2, 3 times 3, 4 times 4, 5 times 5. Now, not all of these numbers um, are odd numbers, so that's the first thing you'll have to make a decision about. Um, so we're looking for our products, um, and you can work that. You can work that out. So you have an odd number of smaller squares. All right. And although you are going to draw a picture to support your answer, I thought I might just remind you that even numbers end in 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8. Uh, they will divide by 2, exactly. And odd numbers end in 1, 3, 5, 7 or 9. And an odd number will not divide by 2, exactly. Okay, on to number six. Uh, draw two different rectangles. Okay, that's the key to this question. Each with an area of 12 squares. 
so that shouldn't be too hard. And I think I might have forgotten to hit pause, but we're going to carry on from where we are now. Okay, so this is question number eight. It says, Dora and Tommy have drawn rectilinear shapes. Here is Dora's, here is Tommy's. Tommy says he has made a different shape with the same area. Do you agree with Tommy? Okay, so what I want you to think about is whether the shape is actually different or whether it has just been rotated. So just moved around, all right, turned. Has it just turned? Because if it's just been turned or rotated, the shape itself is actually the same, okay? So have a close look, see what you think, explain your answer. And number nine says use six square sticky notes or square shapes. Make as many different rectilinear shapes with the squares as you can and uh, draw some of your shapes. Okay, so work hard, have fun.